Colin Kaepernick is back in the news again, and this time he is not slamming America like he did on the 4th of July. This time Kaepernick has been eyed for a position on the Baltimore Ravens team and of course, the internet had something to say about it. Kaepernick is no stranger to controversy and seems to relish the role of angering the majority of the American people. Kaepernick first found himself in in a scalding pot of water after he decided to start kneeling during the national anthem. No matter what people said to Kaepernick or the number of protests that occurred because of it, he continued to kneel. Shortly, after the season ended Kaepernick ended up losing his gig as the quarterback on the San Francisco 49 ERS. Instead of Kaepernick taking this as a wake-up call and dialing back his offensive stance he only held firmer. So, because of those actions, Kaepernick has found it hard to find employment on another football team. Kaepernick has tried to blame the reason he has not found gainful employment on another team on racism, but that could not be further from the truth. Most teams' owners do not want to hire Kaepernick, not because of racism, but on the simple fact of that, he is too controversial. Which is being demonstrated when the Baltimore Ravens approached the idea of signing Kaepernick to their team. Reports began to circulate at the end of last week that the Baltimore Ravens were interested in signing controversial Kaepernick. As soon as word began to trickle out on social media that this could possibly happen fans immediately reacted. Ravens fans started to air their grievances about it online and their message was clear sign anti-American Kaepernick and they are gone. According to one poll, online a whopping 48% of Ravens fans have said they will boycott if Kaepernick was signed. Here is more NBC Sports. If recent comments by Ravens coach John Harbour regarding the potential signing of quarterback Colin Kaepernick were meant to be a trial balloon, it apparently is made of lead. Mike Silver of NFL Media reports that the Ravens have heard from numerous fans regarding Kaepernick in the last couple of days, many staunchly opposed to his signing. It's hardly a surprise, given that Giants CEO owner John Mara already has provided all anti-Kaepernick fans with the blueprint for shouting down a potential Kaepernick signing. All my years being in the league, I never received more emotional mail from people than I did about that issue, Mara said in May. If any of your players ever do that, we are never coming to another Giants game. It wasn't one or two letters. It was a lot. It's an emotional, emotional issue for a lot of people, more so than any other issue I've run into. It's impossible to know whether the fans from whom the Ravens have heard are only Ravens fans, or whether they are fans of other teams who simply want to see Kaepernick remain unemployed. Regardless, it's no surprise that those who don't want to see Kaepernick on an NFL team are trying to block it from happening at a time when it appears that it could. Maybe those who support the employment of Kaepernick you know, those who made his 49 ERS jersey the 17th highest selling jersey in May should start contacting the Ravens as well, regardless of whether they are Ravens fans. Ultimately, the question becomes whether Ravens owner Steve Bisciotti will ignore the noise, positive and slash or negative, and make a decision based solely on the objective of winning football games. After all, that's what the commissioner claims all teams do. Well, it is obvious that the Ravens owners paid attention to the pushback and made the choice to pass on Kaepernick. The Ravens owners decided on Friday to sign 25-year-old David Olson, who most recently played in the Arena Football League. NESN reported. Olsen's resume a former backup at Clemson with no NFL experience certainly pales in comparison to Kaepernick's. And while Harbaugh insisted Friday that Olsen simply was a camp arm, and that signing him wouldn't prevent the team from also adding Kaepernick at some point, Baltimore's transaction still sparked controversy. Many believe Kaepernick is being passed over due to the publicity he's generated while trying to spread awareness of social inequality in America, and a quick look at Twitter after Olsen's signing proved just how polarizing a figure Kaepernick is. Which of course, brought out the social justice warriors to claim that Kaepernick was blackballed.